This is the Cast Triforce puzzle, another limited edition Hanyama puzzle, crossing over with Nintendo's Legend of the Zelda. After the Hyrule Crest, this is the second puzzle in the series and I think it is more beautiful and feels even better in the hands. The goal of the puzzle is to disassemble it and put it back together again. This one only took me around 10 minutes to solve as the mechanism is actually based on a puzzle I have solved before. Now let me show you how it's solved. First, when I shake it, you can hear a lot of rattling noises inside. But when, I, when we are facing this Hyrule Crest, it doesn't move. We, if we flip it over, the three triangles, the bronze triangles, can be moved about, but only halfway. The silver triangle in the middle can freely move. Flip it back over to the front side and it doesn't move. To solve it, first we have to move it halfway. We can see some small openings on the metal. Now we flip it during this situation and we can softly glide the three bronze pieces outwards. And when you see the mechanism, it may remind you of the cast square, which I've solved on this channel earlier. The mechanism is this. There are holes that goes to the corresponding opposite metal poles here. And this side, there is a blockage in the hole. These two, these two poles in the same piece actually moves opposite to each other. So if one drops in, the other drops out. That stops the gliding and opening of the puzzle. To solve it, the mechanism is that we have to flip the puzzle to one way and move it halfway like this. And the pole is being blocked by the other side opening with a middle blocker in the hole. Once that is done, we can flip it over to the other side, which makes all the poles to be contained within this bronze piece. And when these are all done, we can slide or glide the three bronze pieces outwards in an upright position, so all the poles will not be in the way. Like so. To reset the puzzle, we have to make sure all the pieces are facing the correct position or every piece is facing the same way. And we can tell the position or the direction by using the holes. So all three holes with, uh, does not have the blockage. And we can place this silver piece in the middle. Now it's a small coordination puzzle where we have to place all the three pieces and slide them together at the same time. So we have to find the position where it can happen. Do it in an upright position so all the poles will be contained within the bronze piece. And like this. That's it, solved. It is not super difficult once you know the mechanism and it only takes two moves technically to open it. However, it is an excellent fidget, fidget toy and I have been solving it for over 20 times. I think it is a must have for any Zelda fans. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Bye.